Anthropic have literally just released a new feature for Claude's code called Custom Subagents. Yes, you could always run multiple subagents, but you don't have much control over them. With this new update, you can configure them for specific tasks, give them a name, restrict what tools they have access to, and even give them a unique color. Let's go through some examples. And before we do, make sure you hit subscribe. Support for custom subagents is only in version 1.0.60. So make sure you have that version which should give you access to the new agents command. Here you can see the default general purpose agent, which is always available, but we don't have any new custom agents. So let's create one and we'll set it to the personal level so all our projects have access to it. Then we'll hit generate with Claude, which means Claude will help us generate an MD file for our agent. And all we have to do is give it a description. So I'm gonna say senior software engineer expert at fine grained detail and logic when it comes to reviewing code for quality, security, and best practices. Then hit enter and Claude will generate our agent's configuration. Once it's done, we can select the tools you want to give our agents access to and even view the individual tools. Since our agent is going to review code, I'm only going to give it access to read only tools and you can see the full list of tools it has access to down here. What's really cool is that we can even create an agent that just has access to specific MCP tools. I'm gonna hit continue then give it a color. And now we can see the name Claude has given our agent, the full list of tools it has access to, and a description as well as a system prompt. I'm gonna hit enter, and we can see our new agents down here. We can view the agent's full description, color, system prompt, and so on. And if we wanted to, we could modify that description for our specific needs, and even share them with others on GitHub, which means at some point in the future, there's gonna be a page of awesome Claude code sub agents. But for now, I'm gonna leave things as they are. So to use this agent, I'm gonna write a prompt to review the security of a specific file using subagents. And now we can see Claude has chosen to use the subagent and the subagent is going to work. And now it's done, we can see it took over one minute, used just over 20K tokens, and has given us a full security review of that file. Apparently, Claude's code will automatically select a subagent based on the task, but I haven't got it to do that yet. Anyway, let's have a bit of fun with custom subagents. So this is a list of 10 custom subagents and one general purpose one, some of which are from the example subagents in the documentation. And we're going to try and run as many of them as we can in one single prompt. So I'm going to say, check the code quality, performance, error handling, and metrics of all the code in the components directory, then refactor, write tests, and write documentation for all the code using subagents. And now let's see what happens, fingers crossed. And now Claude has created a to-do list referencing specific subagents. It's using the code quality subagent, which it's done in a minute. And now it's using the performance optimizer and it keeps going assigning agents in sequence. So one after the other, but I do know it can run agents in parallel. I just don't know why it hasn't chosen to do it here. So after about an hour and 500,000 tokens later, everything has finished giving me quality code analysis, performance analysis, error handling analysis, metrics monitoring, and just basically made my code a bunch better by adding comments, tests, and generating API documentation. So glad I'm on the Max account because this would have cost a fortune using the API. Now it's important to note that sub agents have their own context window and use a clean slate each time they're invoked, which could affect performance if they need to gather context to do their job. Check out the documentation for more details. Okay, time for my honest thoughts. I think sub agents are a super cool feature but personally, I don't think I'll be using it that much because the tasks that I use Claude code for aren't hyper-specialized. But it's nice to see Anthropic are always thinking of ways to push Claude code. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Again, don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, happy coding.